So you notice that your check engine light just does not go off and you're curious to see what's going on. Hi, I'm Barbara Terry with AutoMD. Your check engine light will typically stay on until that problem is fixed. You'll want to use an OBD scanner in order to retrieve those diagnostic codes. Parts and tools needed. For this project, you will need an OBD scanner. Your own vehicle's components and parts may differ, so always refer to your vehicle's owner's manual for details. For your safety, we recommend wearing safety glasses, latex gloves, and closed-toed shoes when working on your vehicle. The first thing you'll want to do is actually run your vehicle to see if your check engine light is on. This is the OBD scanner, which needs to be connected to the OBD output underneath the steering wheel in your vehicle. In order to retrieve the trouble codes, you'll want to turn your ignition on in your vehicle. You may receive one code or you may receive five. It's important to address all the trouble codes that you do receive. Once you diagnose the exact part that's making that engine light come on, you'll want to replace it. Once you replace that faulty part that's actually making that engine light come on, you'll want to use the scanner in order to erase the codes. You'll then want to start your car in order to see if that engine light is off. If it's off, you've obviously fixed your problem. If not, you'll want to rescan it. On behalf of AutoMD, I'm Barbara Terry. Without a check, your engine light status.